all right guys so to get rid of stretch mark we're going to be making use of aloe vera gel okay now you can either choose to make use of this um one or you can use the fresh aloe vera gel okay aloe vera is an antibacterial and anti-inflammatory agents because of the presence of <coughs> auxins this helps to reduce scars it also contains an ingredient that stimulates the skin and it also helps to create a new skin so it will help in removing um, stretch mark and then we're going to also be making use of coconut oil now coconut oil is known to contain property that fits and moisturizes the skin coconut oil is the best skin for a softer skin uh, is the best remedy for a softer skin it helps to heal dryness on the skin and it also helps to heal bones it contains an ingredient that helps to remove stretch mark from the skin therefore healing the skin and then we're going to be making use of the toe now using the toe in this remedy would help so much in activating the effects of this of this lotion on the skin therefore removing stretch mark okay these are the first three ingredients that we're going to be needing and now I'm going to be introducing the second one now the second ingredient is going to be baking soda now baking soda contains an ingredient that helps to protect the skin it exfoliates dead skin cells baking soda helps to get rid of pimples blackheads and acne it also helps to remove dead skin cells therefore cleaning the pores so using it in this remedy would effectively help us to scrub out the dead skin cells and repair the skin in a place where you have stretch mark and then we're going to be mixing it with lemon now lemon is citric in nature and as such it is ideal for the skin it contains vitamin C that helps to glow the skin and it contains a huge vitamins that helps to keep the skin even tone it boosts the body immune system and it also contains a stringent property that helps to motivate your pores close large and open pores and help to tighten the skin right so this is now the second ingredients that we're going to be needing okay the first one is going to be scrub and the second one is going to be a lotion now let's prepare this okay let's start by preparing the lotion all right guys so the first thing um, we're going to be needing is the aloe vera okay now you can actually take as much quantity as you want but for this mix I'm going to be needing to take just two tablespoons of this aloe vera and if you want to have much of it then you can take about four tablespoons okay and this is going to be okay for now so the next thing we're going to be putting in is the coconut oil and in this one we're going to be taking in two tablespoons it's going to be okay okay so here I have two tablespoons of aloe vera and two tablespoons of coconut oil. And now for the um, the toe, you're going to be needing just a little quantity, okay? So half cup of the dito, a mini dito. This is actually the smallest size of dito. 
so half cup of that is going to be okay Now, after we've actually mixed, put in all the ingredients together, then we are, we are going to be mixing it, okay? Just stir it up. Now, let me tell you how it smells, okay? It smells, um, you know, the Dito has a very strong smell. So, basically, what you're going to be smelling here is more of the Dito. So we're going to mix it very very well to give us a nice consistency. Alright, so this is perfect guys. Now in this one, you can actually turn it into an airtight container. Okay, this lotion. Turn it into an airtight container and you are good to go guys you're going to be using this for like um two to three months okay because stretch mark does not actually just go off on the skin in a twinkle of an eye okay it takes a little time and a little patience and a little consistency okay like you have to apply this every day on the affected area where you have stretch marks okay and it's just going to heal the stretch mark it's going to heal the skin it's going to contrast the skin back to its original state and the stretch mark will be gone all right so let me mix up the scrub then i'm going to be showing you how to apply this on your skin all right guys so to make sure that this treatment works really well you have to mix up the um scrub and for this one i'm also going to be taking two tablespoons of that i'm going to be mixing it up with a little bit of lemon So I'm going to press in the quantity that will be enough to mix 2 tablespoons of this baking soda, okay? Alright, so I'm actually pressing 2 tablespoons of the lemon. Now, let's mix first so we don't have a consistency that is too liquid because we need this to be a scrub. okay so this consistency is actually um okay all right let me press in a little more juice yeah that is okay this consistency is perfect on the skin all right guys so let me tell you why you should use scrub first before you apply a lotion okay so here i have my scrub and here I have the lotion okay you need these two treatments to scale through stretch mark on your skin so if you're experiencing stretch mark you actually do need these two treatments like consider it very perfect together so the first thing you're going to do is to take the scrub and then um, you have to scrub your the affected area where you have um stretch mark now let me let me tell you this when you mix baking soda with lemon it actually does make it really really soft it makes the mixture really soft so it's going to be friendly for your skin but you have to apply a little bit of force especially on the affected area where you have stretch mark okay so you scrub it very well like i'm actually showing you this guys because i actually do not have stretch mark anywhere except a little on my boobs which i've actually been treating but for now i actually can show you my boobs okay 
so I would have to show you using my hands you scrub it very very well for like three to five minutes and you can leave it on the affected area for another five minutes okay then you would it will sink into your skin allow it to sink into your skin really really well for that five minutes okay as you stay for that five minutes it's going to work really fine on the skin all right so after that then you actually go wash it off scrub your skin with these guys you would have to store this you can store this for one week and it's going to last as long as that okay then for the cream after you've washed you're going to notice that the skin on that part is going to get softer so what you do is to grab this cream and you rub it generously okay you rub it generously on that place generously on that place where you have the stretch mark okay just like that in a circular motion you would have to massage it till the cream um absorb like your skin absorb the cream all right until there will be no cream left on the, your skin anymore then you would have to you know hold it on and it's gonna dry there it's gonna dry there and the next thing you're going to do is just to allow it don't do anything with it don't touch it and for this lotion guys you can actually put it in an airtight container like this just like this container okay you put it inside here and then you cover it okay you would have to cover it and then you continually use it it's not gonna go bad it's just gonna be there and you're gonna apply it apply it for the space of three months okay and scrub your skin anytime you want to apply this now this is so that the treatment can work effectively 